Hello YouTube, thanks for watching another Visual Basic tutorial. One of our subscribers asked me recently uh, how to play sound in your game, uh, in particular in a Visual Basic game. So what we want to do is talk about how to get the sound first, right? Because you can't really play sound if you don't have the sound. So where do you get sound from? Well, one of the really good websites that I have just found for sound is freesound.org. And basically, you go to this website and you just search for a sound. For example, uh, let's say I want um, gun shot sound. So you search for that and then it just comes up with all of these different sounds which you can play and then download if you want and uh, just check with the website whether the sound is free uh, should be free since the website is called free sound um, once you have downloaded the sound uh, make sure they are stored in your project folder if you don't know where your project is uh, inside your game just click on form1.vb or whatever your top form is called and down here in the bottom right corner in the properties menu there's a full path property and you just this tells you the folder where your game is stored so go to that folder and uh, make sure that you save the two uh, or what however many sound files you download into this folder so I have just downloaded explode.wav and shoot.wav so now I have two sound files that I'm gonna play in my game okay the next thing you do in your game is at the form level so at the top level I'm going to declare a sound uh, variable so you do this by uh, saying uh, at form level uh, ding uh, I'm gonna call it uh, just sound as uh, new media dot sound player and this will declare this variable as a sound object so whatever properties you set uh, will be related to sound so the next thing you do is you decide where you want to play this sound so I'm going to play this sound whenever I press space to generate the sound for the missile. So I'm going to press, I'm going to type in sound dot sound location, which will set the uh, file name of the sound. Uh, and I'm going to call it uh, fire or what was it? Shoot dot wav. And then I'm going to play the sound sound dot play and hopefully this means that when I'm playing the game uh, it should generate a shooting sound whenever I shoot as you can see here okay the next thing that I'm gonna do is make sure that um, I play some sound for when it explodes so then uh, I have the collision event between two objects so I try to find that so here where it says there is a collision between the enemy and the missile so this is where I insert the code for uh, uh, sound dot sound location and the uh, sound for this the sound file for this was called explode dot wav and I play the sound when the two things when um, the enemy explodes with my missile so let's see what happens so I'll turn the sound volume down just so it's not too loud right, so I press space it shoots and when they collide hopefully as you can see there's a collision sound so try that again oops game over Okay, so hopefully you guys have learned how to insert sound in your game. See you guys next time.